Hi, and welcome to The Incredible Life of Cat. I have a big stack of candles sitting over here. Uh, first of all, um, if you like my content, please like and subscribe. It will help me very much. And with no further ado, we are going to go through uh, my stack of candles here. This is some of my favorite candle designs on the outside for packaging and everything. I am a huge sucker for packaging. I know there's a lot of time and energy that goes into designs and packaging, and I think they're absolutely gorgeous. There are some that are okay to me, but these are some of my favorites. I'm going to start with the most recent, which is Pink Prosecco Frosting. I think that it's absolutely gorgeous colored glass, and, you know, it's just, you know, it's really beautiful writing and design, and I really, really absolutely love the lids. I can't think of anyone that doesn't love the lids, so there's that one. And Toasted Coconut Eclair, if you haven't smelled this yet, um, it smells just like, um, Almond Joy, not Almond Joy, um, I can't remember the name of the candy, oh my god, not Almond Joy, but the other one, um, but yeah, the red one, not the Almond Joy, I don't know why I'm having such a brain fart today, but it smells really, really good. Um, I don't think there's a chocolate note in here. There is milk chocolate frosting. That could explain why it smells like candy. Um, but yeah, no, that one's beautiful. And then I have that green, the springtime in Paris coming. I have yet to try that fragrance. So when I get that one, you guys will know about it. The next one that is my favorite, this is kind of a hard one, is probably this set. I, I'm not sure if this was like a spring release or what. Um, I found these on Mercari. Um, I bought some of them one at, a one at a time, or if there's a set of two. There's Watermelon Lemonade. I know there's more out there. Key Lime Pie. I think it was like some kind of French set a couple of years ago. If it told me the year on here, it'd be great. Um, I think maybe 2018. Um, Pink Petal Tea Cake. This one is actually really good, and I wish they had it like in a body. But it's my angel food cupcake. I've only burned a few of these because I love them so much. But I'm probably going to end up keeping the candle jars after I'm done on these because they're just some of my favorites. I guess maybe it's the kind of sketch design with the picture in the middle. I think it's really cute. The doodle design, I guess you should say. Hot fudge. Oh, this smells so good. So good. Um, Next would have to be, okay, this is kind of funny. This is from uh, this past fall, I believe. It's from a brunch collection. I don't know what the actual collection name was. Pumpkin Pecan Waffles, oh my God. I love this one and I don't burn it because I only bought one of them. I know there's a dupe for it at Walmart for like five bucks. Banana Walnut Muffin. This one is actually excellent too, but you know, I'm, I'm kind of like, there's going to be so much more stuff for me to love that I should burn these. <clears throat> Next one. I like the kitty cartoony ones, so don't judge me. Land of Sweets, there's Blueberry Sugar. I was able to find that one. And Lant Ski Lodge, which is actually um, Hot Cocos and Cream. This is another one. I wish I had more of the body care. And this was from, I'm not sure what year, but um, Perfect Pumpkin. I like that one. It's really cute. It was a little black kitty. I have two black cats, so one was actually in my last video, and I didn't know it until I watched the video myself. <coughs> Excuse me. This one is from Goose Creek. Um, I think it's the kitchen collection or the writing collection. It's supposed to smell like... Um, I think maple French toast. This smells like maple bacon. This I'm going to have to put in my weird candle collection video, weird fragrance collection, weird candle fragrance. I haven't decided how I'm going to do that one. Um, next is chocolate marshmallow cloud. 
This one is to die for. Those of you that like chocolate and love gourmand, this one is so good. I need to find some more from this collection. I'm really loving the packaging on this. It goes all the way around little chocolate bars. I, I just, I can't get enough of it. It's so adorable. And then, okay, last but not least, these two espresso bar. I like that one. It's like a clean package, but also smells like coffee. I mean, come on, you slap a cup of coffee on a candle, I'm probably going to buy it. So mocha latte swirl. This one's really good too. I have another one that's like a, another white mocha one besides the, um, the ones for DW that, um, actually I should just include those since they're right here. The DW home candles. These are also some of my favorites. I have, they're from the Cup of Joe collection and Valent I think these are the Valentine's collection, but they have a Cup of Joe one with different like Halloween ones and a set. I actually have a set coming of the Cup of Joe stuff from DW Home because they're all shaped like this and I'm really excited about that. Oh, I can't get enough of that strawberry. But no, these are like my favorite packaging so far for candles. And I'm going to be doing one for my body, like my fine fragrance mist. I really haven't made a decision or a list, but these I was able to like look through them really quick and find what I was looking for. So I just grabbed them off the shelf and decided to make this video. But I will probably post it tomorrow, probably early in the morning, I'm guessing. But that is all for today. So remember, like and subscribe to my videos and I'll be talking to you soon. Bye.